Hello ladies and gentlemen, Adrian here for DigitalDojos.com and today we're going to be taking a look at an overview of Novation Launchpad. So nowadays with our applications, whether it's iOS or Android, they give us the ability to create really amazing things and I'm always on the lookout for fun apps. Uh, like Novation Launchpad, which allow you to create, in this case, music. You can create and remix music. It's available for the iPhone and iPad free with some in-app purchases through the store. I recommend getting it for the iPad, however, just for the larger work area. And, you know, you have a lot of great features and it utilizes the iPad screen really well. So when you first launch the app here, you have sessions. This allows you to pick your essentially genre or, or style of music, dubstep, hip hop, house, etc. Then you can set things like beats per minute and then go ahead and open your project here. You can also view your own recordings, view the store if you'd like, and more. So they send, they sell some other sound packs that you can get, et cetera. But I'm gonna go ahead and jump into the, the actual launch pad here. And as you can see, it's a multi-button grid interface that makes it super simple to make your own beats. Uh, keep in mind that you can combine beats, bass lines, melodies, vocals, you can do sound effect loops, all completely free. And this is great because whether you're somebody like me who has no musical background whatsoever, it really does make you feel like a somewhat of a professional. And if you are a professional, then all the better because you have really great tools at your disposal here to record, edit, and share. So it really, again, it's as simple as just tapping on any of these things here to go ahead and start making a beat. You can play up to eight of them simultaneously. So you have these individual um, columns here that you can pick one from each of them. So let's go ahead and just put something together here. So you can see there already have a beat going just three simple taps and again you can pick one from each column so if you pick for example if I pick a bass line here and I want to switch it to the one above it, I just tap on the one above it, it'll cancel out and then switch over and it's really that simple and you can see you get visual feedback of each track that's playing here and then you even have some sound effects on the right here And just like that, I can cancel them out. And it's that simple to make beats, not that Skype login sound that you just heard. But again, really simple, really easy. And of course, you can record it here on the right. You also have options for your filters for each individual column here. You can adjust the volume for each individual column. So if you want, for example, uh, the lead here, I can make this louder than the bass so I can increase that audio and then lower the bass line and change the way that that sounds entirely. You also have effects. Now these are things that you have to get through uh, in-app purchases. So if you want to unlock things like gators, stutter effects, uh, auto filters, you can get all those through in-app purchases. At the top here, you have the option to view your recordings that you've made. So you can see I made one right here. And if you click on them, you can see you can actually share them out directly to Dropbox, SoundCloud, email them, YouTube, or Facebook. So not only does it give you the option to create, but instantly go out there and share it with the world essentially. You can go ahead and edit effects. Again, this is an in-app purchases. You can go and check that out. You have the ability to completely customize your pad here. So earlier you saw me pick a, a you know genre sound pack of hip hop, but you can actually mix it up. So if you want multiple sounds from different sound packs, you can go ahead and you know change it up to your liking here. You can even pick uh, from different categories like drums, guitar, sounds, percussion, different instruments and, and sound effects. You can go ahead and add that all to your own custom pad here. You can adjust loops, the sync bar, the gain of the overall uh, sound here. And then you can even set favorites so you can easily grab from your sound, uh, your, your favorites here and then edit your pad to your liking. So it really is that simple. But again, taking it a step further, you have other in-app purchases like the $6.99 in-app purchase, which you can get to go ahead and import your own sounds. So if you have samples from your computer that you can easily import those and play with your own sounds and vice versa. Like again, you can share your sounds out to your computer and then you know fine tune your audio project, your song, your beat, whatever it is. It's just a really fun tool that I've been messing around with. I really like these music creation apps and uh, Novation Launchpad is one that just makes it super simple and super easy. Uh, again, you can find this completely free in the app store for iPhone or iPad. Uh, whether you're an amateur like me or a professional, this is just one of those apps I really, really enjoy and just has a lot of fun playing around with. Definitely worth checking out. All links will be in the video description below. That all being said, don't forget to head over to Digital Dojos for more content. Like this video if it helped you out or you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. And leave some comments down below on your own favorite music apps that you want to recommend, music creation apps or what have you. Be sure to drop them down below and I'll be sure to check them out. And as always, thanks for watching.